children today we are going to learn how to draw ray diagram which shows why a pencil partially immersed in water appears bent so first i am drawing a container if you want to learn this ray diagram draw along with me first draw a container then draw a line or a pencil or simply a rod which will represent pencil or rod which is partially immersed in water partially immersed means a part of it is inside the water and part of it is above the water it can be any other liquid also so see how i have drawn the pencil or the rod or the stick which is partially immersed in the water now you are supposed to show through the rays why it appears bent when anybody sees it obliquely obliquely means not from the above but from the this side or this side of the container so children first you draw a line which is straight vertical and it goes without any deviation when it passes from water to air because if any ray incidents over the water surface normally then it goes without any deviation so one ray light ray which is starting from this tip of the pencil this goes straight another ray you can take which is incidenting on the water surface obliquely like this right now draw a normal here when light ray moves from denser medium that is water to air it goes away from the normal it was moving like this instead it bends away from the normal you can take one more ray like this and now before drawing the refracted ray do one thing draw this ray back dotted line see how i am drawing it draw this line back this ray meets this ray virtually at this point image is always formed image of image of the object after refraction when either refracted ray meet at the retina or <coughs> either refracted ray actually meet after refraction or they meet virtually here according to the law of refraction see this second ray also see how i am drawing the refracted ray of second ray i will join this point of incidence with this point where this ray is coming back and meeting this normal ray draw it first outside the water and then continue drawing it back now these two rays after refraction are not going to meet anywhere this is the observer's eye these two rays will not meet after refraction anywhere in this space but if you draw them back they appear to meet virtually at this point so what we say this is tip of the stick or pencil and its image is formed here virtual image similarly every point of this stick has its image which is raised from the actual position of the object and you will have image of this whole stick like this so when you observe this pencil or a stick from this side actually you are not observing the actual stick you are observing the image of the stick and that is why you see the pencil or the stick bent like this this is the answer why pencil which is partially immersed in the water appears bent and how you are supposed to draw the ray diagram so now let us see what is the question why pencil appears bent when partially immersed in water 
and the answer will be pencil appears bent when partially immersed in water because we see the image of part o a as o dash a dash due to refraction